Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Welcome to vlog number three. Starting today off on a beautiful sunny day with all the sakuras around here. And yeah, today is a Wednesday. I'm sorry, starting off a little bit late. Uh, I didn't do much at all on Monday or Tuesday. Today, uh, this week is the last week before exams start, so it was really busy. But I feel like it's finally spring. It's warm enough to go around with like a t-shirt. It's beautiful, look at all this. Sakura River. Also, I went to Shibuya yesterday, so here's a quick snippet of that. We'll be going to volleyball later today and I will be wearing something ridiculous. It's me, Mario! And now we play the volleyball. It's very hot in this, but no problem. I got a Mr. Naruto san. Konnichiwa! Hey. <laughs> Let's play! When I got back from school, my bike got confiscated by the bicycle police people. Yes, the main transport in Japan is mainly by train, but getting to the train station, you need your bicycle to ride there. And now I'm on my way to go pick up my bicycle. Gosh, stress. taking me to my bicycle and these are all the illegally parked bicycles that they've taken away hey I found my bicycles over here okay so now that I've got my bicycle I need to pay a 3,000 yen fine oh my god yay I finally got my bike back so it was a really simple process all you gotta do is uh, fill in your address your name your n telephone number and then pay the 3,000 yen this week's vlog is going to be mostly about cycling and you're going to see why later. So I don't know my way home but I'm hoping to follow the tracks to my station is so I kind of get an idea where I am. I'm going to do that clicky thing again so here you go. Three, two, one. told me there's gonna be a little car meetup and I'm here exploring it. I'm not gonna say where but there's a lot of cool cars so check this out.
was the police just now, but because he was going that fast. Damn! He was going so fast the police didn't even bother. Oh my god, Japan, you got you this is crazy. This is way too crazy. So basically, the police are only here to kick out the people who parked in the truck spot. Which means I gotta move too. <laughs> the police has left, everyone is back again. Damn, Japan, back at it again with the supercars. Good morning. It is now 4.40 in the morning and I'm gonna start my adventure to the place I'm going to. I'm gonna keep that a surprise still until I get there. It's gonna be amazing, but it takes me about three hours to get there. So, I'll update you guys over there. So after the three hour train ride and a little bit more, we finally arrived. We are now at Mount Fuji and we're gonna have a cycling trip here with uh, our schoolmates. And I'm really excited for this because I've actually brought my bike from Hong Kong. Wow! First stop, we're at Shiogama Shrine and I'm out of breath because we just walked up all these stairs. So check this out. So we just finished eating at Hotofodo. It's yeah. a really funny, interesting dome noodle restaurant and the noodles are just bomb. The noodle also very big. So now we came up with a really stupid idea to try and make our way onto that little island temple. We don't know how, but we're gonna try anyways. Okay, quick right update. Right the, right above the water is freezing cold. Like our feet, our feet feel numb. We're on the first island. Hello. Now we gotta make it over there. We got like two hours to go. We got ducks. We can do this. We're now crossing in the lake. It's very cold, but luckily it's not that deep. There's rocks down here, so we gotta be careful that we're barefoot, but woo, we're nearly there. Almost there. So we were right over there when we said we wanted to come here. And now we made it.
All right, that sums up our cycling trip at Fuji. It was great fun. Everyone enjoyed themselves. Thank you very much to our captain of TUJ Cycling Club, uh, Mr. Afro Man, aka John, and uh, vice captain here, Corey. Brilliant fun. Thank you guys for organizing it. And yeah, I'll see you guys next week for vlog number four.